Hello guys, this is Hexagon Zero, and welcome back to another episode of Battlefield 4 Commander Mode. Oh, alrighty then. We are here on Operation Wavebreaker. Oh, sorry, no operation there. It is just Wavebreaker. And we're not doing so hot. Actually, we're doing pretty okay. Other than the fact that we have nothing in terms of C, D, and E, we do have a couple of the outlier objectives. And as I've always said on Wavebreaker, actually, I think we've done this map rather close, or it might have been another Naval Strike map. Anyway, Naval Strike maps are played so much, it's all honestly getting a little bit annoying. Anyway, what um, people don't often realize is that you don't need this. Yeah, it's cooler to fight in here. You've got the Levolution, you've got all that stuff in here, but uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3. Uh, notice the odds here? It's significantly harder to uh, control the game when you're inside. If you can control the inside and maybe one or two of these outside liars, then you're... Wow, that's pretty impressive. But most of the time, it's just the ins just the uh, it's just the insides that never get damaged, and the outliers don't change much. Luckily, that's been changing recently. Um, there have been uh, better attempts, and now we control uh, well, at least one on the inside. While well, we're having a bit of an issue, judging by these attack boats that are. What is that? One, two, three. That's not good. We're losing this battle and we're losing it fast. Okay, what do we need to do to turn this around? How not be here. Got it. Um. Ah, oh, who am I facing? 69 Cadillac skills. Okay. Alright, we're holding F and G pretty well. That's our spawn. Our attack post is rolling out, so is that guy. We're gonna get a bit more strength now two attack boats right there that isn't gonna end well I see this is talk be advised we can relay HV tags to your squad's maps is this attack chopper in control enemy EMP deployed mm, not really it appears we have. Talk confirmed. Oh. Enemy gunship destroyed. It appears they have killed our. All right. Well, the gunship will give a bit of an aerial advantage for the uh, surrounding objectives, but currently we control three. We're starting to recap. No, we're losing this guy. You can move up. If he captures that, you'll have a lot more to deal with. Wrong firing, he's gonna return fire and you're gonna die. Yeah. That's the problem. We have a sniper over here trying to lie damage down. Damage has been attained, that objective will now fall. We need to get that. Who is that? This squad. Hostiles are trying to locate your vehicles. Reinforcement. Needs to be given a rapid deploy. If they get this objective before that attack boat does, we're going to have issues. Need to control these outliers. Hostile UAV sweeping for your squad. We've got to tell people to get out of the gunship now. Um, no, not F. Head over to G. H. Ah, uh, sure, stay there. They have get out. Got shut down. Shit. Not enough time. <laughs> I tried. Um. Where have my. I have just discovered several new hotkeys. For example, where the hell did my where did my information go? EMP drone is airborne. Can I have have a target back? It's been way too long. I'm not. Enemy personnel scan detected. Control three of the. F Eight, six, a number of something. Holy moly! 
Something's going on with this. Why are you seeing in here? I don't like it when you see. When you see, my people die. Ah, uh, Scout Heli Heaven. Playing Havoc over here. Oh, that was a bad idea. There's two attack boats rolling in on that position. They're going to have a nice angle. What's hitting them? Oh, it's a long range boat. Be advised, resupply is on station and ready to deploy. Now it's always a good strategy is if you can land on top of this actual mountain. And then you can actually capture these objectives just standing on the talk, your HVT Yeah, just standing on top of these Besides ledges here. The capture range is that big. The only issue They're hmm, scanning for your positions. Is that it makes you a little bit easier to kill from aerial targets. But then again, there's not really many aerial targets here. I need to figure out how to get this back. Roger actual. HVT assignment is up. Is it Alt Shift? No. What was I trying to hit? Alt K? Shift K? No. Control K? No. This Shift K? No. Shift. They're trying to disrupt with the MP. No. Control Enter? No. Alt that. Not minimize. Sorry. That's a. Uh, 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 what's the name for it? Um, windowed mode. I don't think we're gonna win this one. They're too strong. We, we're, we're doing a nice job of trying to capture different objectives, but they keep on countering us too quickly with vehicles. We need to either control D and take advantage of the gunship to blow up their... Because really what's killing us now is these attack boats. Our attack chopper was doing okay. Could you stop that? It literally does nothing. I don't believe you should ever use proxy attack unless it's there's no other use for it. Network. Or you could... Uh, and there's always a use for a proxy attack. But people don't... Some commanders don't understand what proxy attack is. It's not just something to piss off the enemy commander for 15 seconds. It's it's an incredible tactical value. I mean, it, it can block incoming cruise missiles. Okay, now we're starting to turn ourselves around, but we're losing G. Or at least starting to. Hold on. Mm. My scan's full up in the air, I don't got anything. Um... There's another one there. Two more there. What squad's that? It's two different squads. Where's the squad leader? Uh, inside of their EMP range. Come on, where's that proxy attack? I need to be able to assign to the squad. Not proxy. Ah, oh, okay, well. See there, that's an example of a proxy attack. Squad is now and this isn't telling me who's alive or dead. Heads up, here I need to see these reading. views. What What did I do that to make that... What was I trying to hit? Did I hold control and hit K? No. Okay, no. Vehicle ISR ready. This and enter, no. Most astounding. Mm, too many of these there, small area. Alarm. I hate this guy. He's very good. Starting to lose A again. EMP drone is away. He's close enough that this scout heli should be able to pick him up. Where are you? I value target is online. Unknown. What squad's that? Multiple Copy squads. That. Tactical ISR initiating. This is Tac Ops. EMP is ready. Deploy is needed. We can't pull out of this. There's too many of them. They move too quickly. Their vehicles are too strong, and they're. Roger. Sweep and scan commencing. 
I hate this. Why can't I see what's Be advised, talk now able to relay HVT assignment to your squad. No, oh, I can use WSD to do this, okay. Now the keys do it. These letter keys. And nothing else. The scout hell is capturing this position alive. when. Oh! Tag boat is in. Hmm. Roger. Squad maps updated. many options here. All we need to do is control these outliers and then we can have them bleeding. Roger, understood. We need help. Squad has been promoted. What have I Oh. Gunship control. Excellent. Gunship inbound with attack. D story. D destroy. Something else is here. Um we could try moving around to the la oh, get out of the gunship. I can't tell who's in it because this this thing has been minimized. Enemy is scanning the AO. Is he trying to say hacks or heck? Okay, this guy's really getting on my nerves. Where is he? I think we eliminated the attack boats. Systems repair complete. Network is good to go. It doesn't matter if there's almost not no Yoshi. I guess these little uh, this is this isn't a glitch because there's these little bars beneath it showing the status of how full the squad is. Squad G's are requesting a scan. You're in an attack boat. I'm not going to scan you. You're going to leave in half a second. UAV is deployed. Hmm. And this chat lag is not good. Enemy just lost their helo. If we can keep this up, controlling this many objectives at the same time, they're bleeding in an excessive rate here. At sometimes a double ticket count bleed, but uh, I don't think we can keep it up. There's simply too many concentrated in one area. I can't supply drop into the mountain, which is something I think they need to fix on this map. Uh, and all maps that have a large area with buildings, uh, but we're Scanning we're losing. They can feet. move too quickly. That can't control it hard enough. There's too many in that vicinity, and I wish I could tell who's being assigned to what. Because right now I. I hope this goes away in the next game. Because if it stays this way, I'm going to have to look up how to fix it. I can't tell if our gunship's still up because it doesn't always appear on this map. 
Well, I know it's not up now because they have control D, but we still control the majority of objectives. They're just not bleeding at a double ticket rate anymore, which is what we need. We're down. They're down to nearly three, three hundred and a half, but we're just hitting our hundred mark, and we're losing C already, our main control on the inside. But at the same time, we are gaining back this objective, which is good. But I still think we need to keep on taking care of these out outliers. Um, Ready to sweep for hostile shooters. Now what we can do here is most of their forces are concentrated as ground forces. What that means is that we can control the outlier objectives without having these guys easily able to get to us without becoming snipers or sniping with rockets. And then we just have to deal with vehicles and swimmers. Swimmers are fairly easy to deal with, um, despite even if you dive under you still leave a bubble trail behind you. But the issue is still that we cannot defend against these vehicles without a vehicle support of our own. And our vehicles are either being stolen or taken care of very quickly. They control the majority of objectives, although if we can get G here, then we'll be okay. We still have an attack boat in here, although I think it just got destroyed. Um. Roger. Region if we clear. can just hold this, and maybe harass them a little bit on the inlier objectives, we can, we can win. High value target assignment but is we have online. to be careful, make every bullet count, aim for the head or upper torso, do not be shooting feet here. Really, he had another line for a period? Bit too excessive there, bud. There's three guys in a building. We've got an attack boat on it. This should be falling pretty quickly, but stay inside those capture ranges, people. We're not going to get much just by hitting this. <sighs> We're falling too fast. We need to get two objectives in here and then control all of the outside objectives just to win at this rate, given the ticket bleed. But we're bleeding way too fast here. And now we're losing A because we don't have enough guys to control every single objective. Or we have too many going on the inside, but we need many on the inside just to harass them enough that their foot soldiers don't get the idea that they should run outside. Order received by squad leader. And also, I think a change they can make is that these scans, they should be able to penetrate EMPs. Considering what's actually happening is that these aren't um, satellite blockages. These are what I'm assuming to be some sort of ground scan. Or at least that's what they could call it. Enemy EMP deployed. I don't like it when people EMP my place. That's not good either. Alright, we got D back. The only issue with controlling D and not one of these guys is the fact that you can lose... Enemy gunship has been shot um, down. You can lose D very quickly. Because of uh, the, um, you, you're fighting a war on two fronts, or a battle on two fronts, it doesn't end well. And the fact that we have multiple characters hiding out in the hills here is is not good for business. Ready to sweep for enemy infantry. The guy parachuted in. Promotion successful. 17 tickets left to 200, unless we captured all objectives immediately, right? Oh, you little bugger! Just for that bucko, choke on that. Squad alerted. Advises needed. Talk out. Ah. It was a good game, but we... 186 tickets to zero. That's not bad for Wavebreaker, especially on a server ticket count as high as this one. Actually, no, it's an 800. That's that's okay. I usually like to have my games. If I'm going to lose, at least 150, and we're slightly above that.
Ah, well, we put up a good fight. Those teams are fairly evenly matched. I'm happy with my team's performance in here. And like most maps and servers nowadays, we're not going to get a score screen here. So I would like to thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like, favorite, subscribe, comment, and all of that good stuff. And I will see you guys next time. This is the Hexagon Zero, signing out.